Hey you guys, Tiffany here. Welcome to Our Organic Life. So we have ducks and chickens running together in our pasture flock. And while they do great together, ducks, whenever they drink water, they tend to get a lot of uh, back feed of dirt, mud, grass, things like that. And they really muddy up the, uh, the water source for not just the ducks, but the chickens as well. So I needed to come up with a better source of water for them that the ducks can still get drinks. They have their duck pool that they can play in and swim around in and be happy and get wet like ducks like to do. But I need that clean water source for the chickens. So what we are going to be making today is we are going to make a uh, low waste, clean water, um, poultry waterer for them. So the things that you're going to need for this uh, this DIY is you're going to of course need a bucket. Now this is a food grade five gallon bucket from Tractor Supply so it's going to hold lots of water, plenty of water. It's going to minimize the amount of times that I have to water them which is helpful out here because we don't have power out here still. We're running off of a generator so that's less work for me, less times I have to start the generator to water them. So we've got this bucket, then you're going to need poultry nipples, a set, so I actually um, I will leave a link to get all of these materials down below. These basically, the way that they work is the chickens can tap the uh, tips of them and it will drip down water for them in a slow motion so they can get their drink without back feeding uh, dirt or anything into the water and the water in the main compartment stays clean. So you're gonna need four or more um, poultry nipples. You're gonna need some pipe thread seal tape and this will help lock in um, and seal the bottom of the bucket where the poultry nipples are gonna go. You're gonna need a drill with a 23 by 64 um, drill bit and of course a lid for said bucket. So let's get started. The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna flip this bucket over. Got a little dirt on it, but that's okay. We're gonna flip this dirt, this bucket over and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna drill, we're gonna drill our four holes for our poultry nipples. There we go. Then we're gonna take our poultry nipples and our pipe thread tape. And you want to, um, this is actually from an old waterer. I salvaged these back again. So you want to basically take the uh, thread tape and you want to, um, it's going to turn to the right and you want to make it so that it tightens with it and doesn't come unravel. So you're going to actually kind of counter wrap it. So you're going to right wrap it in the opposite direction, I believe. The idea is that you want whenever it tightens down you aren't going against the direction that you went. It's actually going with it. So put your pipe thread on, make sure you're not covering the hole where the water is supposed to come out. All right, so I got my pipe thread and we're just gonna go ahead and just twist it in. I'll twist it in until it is flush. And some people might argue and say that because there is a uh, rubber gasket on here that the, th the thread tape is not necessary, but I promise you, I have had it actually drip and it's, it really is. You really want that extra security. The last thing you want is to have to take this apart again and redo it because it's dripping and leaking and wasting your water. and then just make sure that this is as down as tight as it'll go and pressed up against the rubber gasket and then you're ready to go. I got some water in here and um, make sure this is good and tight. There we 
we go. All right, so now what we're gonna do, we got Miss, Co Miss Cuckoo here. This is our Cuckoo Moran hen. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna, this is how we teach them to uh, take a uh, poultry nipple. So you basically just take and you guide their beak up and you tap it. You see how she's, you did it a couple times. And that's it. So we're gonna go ahead and also, cause the rest of my hens, they've used poultry nipplers before. Oh my gosh, I'm a sweaty hot mess. But um, the ducks have never used a poultry nipple, so we're gonna go ahead and bring one of them over, and they'll they'll see. Each of them will see the others doing it, and they will learn. So we're gonna catch a, a duck and try this. <laughs> All right, I got one of the Miss Buttermilks. And it looks like this is perfect height, so we're gonna go ahead and dive her beak up. Oh, you gotta get it. So we're gonna kind of open it up a little bit. There you go. There you go. See the water? All right, there you go. <laughs> So that is how I make my DIY poultry water with the uh, poultry nipples and five gallons of water. Clean water, it's gonna stay clean. And you can, that way you can ensure that your flock always has access to fresh, clean drinking water. Thanks so much for stopping in.